Hey, welcome back to Living MN Outdoors, and thanks for joining us for Get Living in the Word, our devotional. Today, Rachel's going to read a story. It's a parable, and it's the parable of the starfish, or also known as the legend of the starfish, and many other names. Here is the legend of the starfish. A young boy was walking along the beach where many starfish had been washed up by the tide. The boy occasionally reached down and tossed a beach starfish back into the ocean. A man walked up to the boy and said, I've been watching what you're doing, son. Do you realize how many starfish are dying on every beach each day? Do you really think that what you're doing is going to make a difference? The boy looked up at the man and then looked down at the starfish by his feet. He picked up the starfish and as he gently tossed it back into the ocean, he said, makes a difference to that one. So guys, what this parable is saying to me is, we're not going to be able to make a difference to every single person on earth. But we can make a difference to the people that are around us. Whether it be a co-worker, a family member, somebody you cross paths with in the grocery store. Um, it's always worth taking that risk to make a difference. Whether it be just opening a door for somebody, helping them carry their groceries, or sharing the word of Christ with them. Every single person is worth taking that risk for. So Rachel's going to read our verse today, and then we'll go from there. Luke 15, 4 through 7 says, Suppose one of you has a hundred sheep and loses one of them. Does he not leave the ninety-nine in the open country and go after the lost sheep until he finds it? And when he finds it, he joyfully puts it on his shoulders and goes home. Then he calls his friends and neighbors together and says, Rejoice with me, I have found my lost sheep. I tell you that in the same way there will be more rejoicing in heaven over one sinner who repents than over 99 righteous persons who do not need to repent. Guys, if we can help one person come to find Jesus, that they can be saved through him, that that's huge. That can change that person's life. That one person can then tell another person who can then tell another person and it's a chain reaction so by taking that one risk and making a difference in one person's life can go on and on and on and on in hundreds or thousands or tens of thousands of people's lives can be changed by taking that one risk making that one difference in one person's life. And I think why this is so important is best said in John 3.16. And we talk about this verse a lot. And that is, For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, so that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. Whoever believes in him will have eternal life. It doesn't get much better than that, guys. Spending eternity in heaven with God Sounds pretty perfect to me. So, our challenge for you this week is make a difference in somebody's life. Share the love of Christ with them. Or maybe start slow, open the door for them. Start a conversation with the coworker at work. But start somewhere and work on making that difference so that one day that one person can spend eternity in heaven with Jesus. Thanks for tuning in to this episode of Get Living in the Word. We hope you enjoyed it. We hope you share it. We hope you take away something from this today. And don't forget to get on out there and get living.